Hey guys, so today we're going to be reading Thomas and the Naughty Diesel. Percy wasn't feeling well, so Topham ha had sent him to the train doctor to get better. I shall have to borrow another engine while Percy is away, so Topham Hatt said. The only engine the other railway could spare was Diesel. Thomas the Tank Engine had remembered how Diesel had caused trouble the last time he came to the station. You've come to help, Thomas said, so no tricks. Tricks, per Diesel. I'm just happy to help you really useful engines again. Good, Thomas said, but he didn't believe Diesel. Diesel set out to work. He was pulling freight cars when he met Toby. Oh, Toby said, it's you. Toby remembered Diesel's mean tricks, too. After you finish your job here, please pull those freight cars to the harbor, said Toby. He wanted Diesel as far from him as possible. Thomas and Toby made it clear to Diesel that they would not stand for any nonsense. No making up stories or causing trouble, Thomas said. Yes, Thomas, Diesel purred. I understand, Thomas. The freight cards knew that Sir Topham had sent Diesel away for troublemaking in the past. Let's have some fun with him, laughed the freight cars. There's Naughty Diesel, they called. Diesel could feel his temper rising. Yes, Thomas, teased the freight cars. I understand, Thomas. Grrr, Diesel roared. I'll teach you. He gave the freight cars a great big push. Crash! Diesel pushed the freight cars right into a fence. Broken wood and upset freight cars were everywhere. Grrr, Diesel growled. Any more teasing and I'll squash you all flat. Sir Topham Hatt was very angry at Diesel. You're going back to the railway as soon as you're finished with our work, said Sir Topham Hatt. Diesel was sad that Sir Topham Hatt was angry with him. Later that day, Daisy was chugging along when she realized she had an oil leak. Thomas will have to take your passengers, said her driver. Thomas started up the hill, but the tracks were oily, and he began to slip. Help, help, said Thomas. Thomas could not stop his heavy train from pull pulling him downhill. Suddenly, Clarabelle's back wheels rolled right off the track into the mud. Serves him right, Diesel said when he heard about Thomas. But Diesel, but then Diesel felt ashamed. Thomas needed help. And Diesel was the closest and strongest engine on the line. I'm coming, Thomas, Diesel called. Bit by bit, Diesel crept forward on the oily tracks until he reached Thomas. Soon, workmen arrived and helped Clarabelle back on the line. They cleaned the oil off the tracks and put dry sand on, him, on them. Diesel dug his wheels into the sand and pushed Clarabelle. Thomas helped, too. Inch by inch, the in engines moved forward. Finally, they chugged back to the station. Thank you, Diesel, said Clarabelle. You were great, Thomas said. And even Sir Topham Hatt was proud of Diesel because he had rescued Thomas and Clarabelle. Everyone hoped Diesel would come again. Diesel hoped so, too. The End If you guys like this video, be sure to like and subscribe. Also, comment down below what your favorite book is. Peace!